Hey YouTube, it's Matt and here's a little cart update. This particular one I found a while on Xmas clear up with round eight. It was at an abandoned house and I must say it is the weirdest bin I've ever seen. Never even knew this brand existed. And here it is. So it's a document destruction bin made by Alibert. Let's see if I can get the shade in. It's got your document destruction slot there. And it's got two lid locks there and there which lock into the side of the bin there and there fortunately it's got a, a big fuck off crack in the side of it which I will be fixing shortly it's just, so it's a 120 and it's made in 1999 very dirty, I'm about to wash out, it was an abandoned house builders have obviously been using it so, if you look at the side, it actually looks more like a Sulo, new Sulo Euro 2360. The fact the raised handles at the back, this bit here, and something unusual for a 120, a footstep in the back. But all in all, this looks very like a Sulo Euro 2360, if any of you have seen that. So you slot the front. So yeah, this one, it's been turbogged, because I emptied it on... Um, Round 8's lorry when I got it, it was full when I found it, so it just saved me dragging it home full. I tipped it. Not really that much markings on it, you can't really see anything. Very good tread on one wheel, and shocking on the other, which I'm guessing might be because one of them may have been replaced in the past. Need to pop these or cut them out. Don't know how I'm going to do that yet. Still in the planning stages. But yeah. So this is the latest bin I've got. Also, the footage of Xmas Clear Up will be up soon, mainly due to the fact it's filmed in HD and Windows Movie Maker doesn't really like it. So I'm going to have to do a bit few um, conversions on it. Whether that will be up, I don't know. Chances are mid-January. Just keep an eye out for that. But anyway, hope you all had a good, very, a good Christmas and a Happy New Year. Thank you for watching.